customers. You guys need anything? But instead, I stood there and went, you geese. These sorts of stories have become known as customer service brain rot. And as someone who spent a summer selling hot dogs, I can confirm that. I'm not even going to lie. That's happened to me. Whenever said someone, um, I've said you too to someone asking me, or someone telling me, enjoy your meal. Like, enjoy your meal. You too. Like, the fuck? It's just, it's, you can't stop it from coming out, you know what I mean? That condition's all too real. At Scrawberry on TikTok's currently doing a great job of collating these. Do follow them if you like, but with all things in life, they are drastically improved by being read out by a middle-aged British man. <laughs> I work at Taco Bell, and instead of calling out a name once, I just yelled, Beefy! I once tried <laughs> to say, I'll have those boneless wings shortly for you, and confidently looked him in the eye and said, I'll be right back with your bones. A customer <laughs> asked if we had shrimp cocktail, and I said, no, we only have wine and beer. This guy asked Damn. what type of fish we have, but I heard dish as in the plate. So I said, a rectangle? Smiling face with smiling eyes emoji. Once asked for someone's These umbilical cord instead of their unlimited card. Analog skeptical face emoji. I once answered the phone with, how can I speak? Rather than, how can I help you? <laughs> and the man said, with your mouth? I accidentally asked a lady over the phone because she told me she was allergic to Swiss cheese. I work at a place with Douglas in the name. Once Fergus delicious was playing and i picked up the phone said delicious oh my I god i asked a customer if no he was that wasn't a slip you definitely intentionally said that there's no way that was a slip you meant you meant to make a joke out of it and it failed and if he had any plates he wanted me to take he said no and i took them anyway and took the fork out of his hand one time a guy <laughs> ordered a plain biscuit and i couldn't find the button for it so i panicked and asked are you sure last week i was trying to manually enter in an item on till and instead of writing pies with a bunch of s's i just wrote piss <laughs> and you could see what, <laughs> what i'm typing fuck? on the customer's side so the whole time when i was fixing it everyone could see loudly crying face emoji last night i greeted a table and and then proceeded to say, did you want, ca can I get start drinks? Try to nah. see two guests enjoy and you guys have a good one at the same time and ended up saying, you guys could drive. I'm a kid <laughs> and I tried to scan a mop and accidentally hit my pregnant customer in the head with it. She looked at me like, uh. a customer <laughs> asked me, do you have any pets? That and noise. I thought she said, do you have a pad? And I responded, any pets? No, but I have a tampon. I nah. was a dairy queen. I knew it was coming. I answered the phone saying, thank you for calling help. How can I dairy you? The lady on the other side said, oh, never mind, guy at my table. Dude. I thought Dairy Queen was just like an American thing. Are they really like international like that? Um, I brought it up because Matt Rose recognized DQ as Dairy Queen. I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know. Ignorance, you know once said well, that'll be all but i heard you're tall so i laughed said yeah i, I get that a lot once i got <laughs> out a cake for a customer and tried to tell her to freeze it until she needed it but accidentally said let's keep you in the freezer eh? i fist bumped <gasps> a guy once because i thought he wanted one but he was just putting change in the tip cup once <laughs> i put a customer's card in their mouth oh, they'd been sorting things what with their hands. They put their card in the mouth and gestured for me to take it tap it and pay for them so i did all that no his hands were now free but book i got it from his mouth i on instant Put it back in. Oh, One time wow. I was telling a customer where the bathroom was. Instead of saying, oh, I was past the fish tank to the left, I stared at him and I said, The fish. A customer asked me where the bathroom was, and I tried to say, well, in the back corner, and you'll find it. But I just said, I'll find you in the corner. One oh, time my I God. Customers are <sighs> yeah, these are funny, but what makes them funny is Matt Rose narrating all of these comments. Like, that's definitely part of it. It's, it's funny. Buggy, I blanked and just said, Do you need a... Uh, and for him, just mind pushing a buggy. Oh, sorry. Do you what? need the old... Uh... Instead of saying Edward what? will be your server, I said Edward will be your Sedward. I was trying to remember <laughs> that I need to grab cucumber and a customer was in my way. I said, excucumber. Went to tell a customer we're fundraising for breast cancer. Looked him straight in the eye and said, we're breast raising. Neutral oh my face god. Once I no, it wasn't going to be good. Words and combined ketchup and mustard into one word <laughs> to make cum turds. I'm not the saying, I'm not repeating that. horrified. <laughs> and the customer her change, which included a quarter with a bird on it. Very confidently went, it's a grouse. Nerd face, smiling face. She just went. 
Uh -huh. Oh, I repeated it and she wasn't interested. Skull emoji. Uh. And then later I realised it was a turkey, so it was a double whammy. Once I was putting mm -hmm. fries on a table and one of the customers reached for one and brushed my arm and I thought it was a bug, so I slapped his hand. Skull emoji, skull emoji. What? Yesterday I asked a customer for his last name and he spelled S-T-E-E-G. And I just looked at him Steve. and went, Steve. <laughs> I was working drive through and we had dog treats and I saw me. Uh, he, he, he did the, uh, he acted as if he was that emoji and that's a hundred percent accurate. I'm always like, <sighs> like that's the sound that I hear whenever I type that emoji. So I asked a person, oh, your puppy like a treat? It was their kid. I work at a cafe mm -hmm. and there's a sandwich called Meatball Melt. Co-worker instead said to a customer, here is your meat belt. One time over the oh, drive wow. through mic, my co-worker loudly screamed, I'm going to shit my pants. <laughs> her mic was on. And oh, my God. <laughs> and when someone ordered a sandwich and I, I asked would them too. what they wanted to name it instead of what their name was for the order. And I started crying. Once at work, I answered the phone with have a good one and immediately hung up. I got yeah. For a job interview, and the boss asked me what I was doing right now, you know, for work, and I said, "Now nothing, just need to hang out at home." I oh my god! Next to where the cigarettes are sold, and multiple times I said, "Best of luck." After selling twenty Marlboro Reds, I gave <laughs> a customer a sample once and meant to say, "Do you want that one, or did you like it?" And I said, "Yeah, you like that." As a door-to-door oh -door solar salesman, I lead a convo at an open door with, "Your son gets a lot of roof," and he said, "Nice try, buddy." Close the door. One time as a huh? server, I was bringing out a pizza. As it started to slide off the tray, I tried catching it with my foot instead of tilting the tray. When I was a waitress, <laughs> someone asked me what the dessert options were, and I meant to say chocolate fudge cake, but instead said chocolate chodge cake. I oh my, that guy. actually sounds, Customer oh my god. I need a few minutes to look at chocolate the menu. I tried to say it was okay, chocolate take the time, cake. and it came out as it's time. When I was a server, <laughs> I had a lady with a baby she was calling Ellie, and I said, oh hey, that's my sister's dog's name, and she she reported me to MGMT. Oh Genuinely my god. It took me way too long to realise that's supposed to be management. I forgot the name of cocktail sauce, so I just stared at my table <laughs> while doing the Italian hand thing, a pinched fingers emoji. And no no way am I Italian. The sauce. Once I was wearing loose but pants, we all know what that is. Customer's card and try to press it against my body to catch it, but it slipped into my pants. One time I tried <laughs> asking a customer, "Do you want your bath bomb in a bag?" But it came out, "Do you want a bath?" And he very politely said. No. One time, <laughs> when I was on register, I asked an older lady how she was paying. She said, cash. And I said, baller. Oh, facts. And she just sort of facts. stared at me. I once did the closing announcement at Asda. Your Asda store is closing in... What's Asda? Now. Once I went <laughs> to use the intercom to make an announcement and said, welcome to... Wait, no, no never mind. Tried to make a quick announcement while mid-conversation and accidentally just said, oh no! <sighs> Over the PA to <laughs> all four concourses. Oh god, well at least it's only a shop, so customers thinking what's the worst that could have possibly happened? Of the airport. I was doing the closing announcement and accidentally knocked the mic over. All you could hear was shush your suck, shush sajun, such such sajun, her such shush. Hey. Repeatedly cursing. One night I was making the closing announcement at work and I said, Attention, customers! I will. Well, we will. A shit and just hung up. One time I turned my headset on and instead of greeting the customer, I said, Nut tap. I don't know how I got there. One time a customer was yelling at me over the phone and he said, Shove a pizza up your ass. And I accidentally said, oh, Okay. I'm no, honestly. The, customer that the register was somewhere else, but I kind of just, Oh, I'll be, um, was pointing my co worker serving pipe. Mate, are you okay? <laughs> don't forget though, the customers don't help. One time when I worked at Taco Bell, I asked the customer if they wanted a hard or soft taco when they replied with what's different when i worked in mackie oh my an old god lady came in and asked for a fillet of shit followed by i don't know why i said that one time <laughs> i was seating a table because you were thinking it to me and said she had a present for me then spitter chewed gum in my hand Work oh my god at a zoo gift shop i was alone in a pop-up shop uh, just reading my Kindle, and a grandma popped her head in, went Woof! and walked out. <laughs> when I was on cashier, I asked. That reminds else? me of the, that uh, video of that English old woman, <laughs> old woman um, Karen. Y'all know that video that was going around on t um, Twitter 
or TikTok or one of them. And the guy was recording her from inside his car or something. And then she, like, holds on to the window as it's, like, I don't know, as it's rolling up, I think. And she yells something insane <laughs> at, at the guy. <laughs> oh, please know what I'm talking about. And one dude did the two fingers touching emoji pose and went, can I? Oh, this is a job for a character we haven't seen in a while who handles all the oo I have to read out. It's oo Jason Statham. Yep. Can I please get a root beer? Oh, my God. Why is that so accurate? So DoorDash order, and they said, no veggies, please. I will die only to order steamed veggies. I asked this lady what drink she wanted, and she said, I don't know, purple, and sat there silently. I used to work at Jam juice and I needed this lady's ID for a membership. She pulled out a pocket sized picture of Jesus. I was kicking <laughs> the lady out <laughs> through her purse looking for a wallet, then pulled out a chicken leg in a Ziploc bag for me to throw away for her. I once went up to McDonald's God. early in the morning and asked, can I have a please burger cheese? <laughs> One time at a subway, I kept asking for a six inch foot long and I kept repeating it until I figured out what I was saying. <laughs> Once just... I ordered a lemonade Yo, did you see it? Rest your aunt and when the waiter oh my God. no did you y'all see subway has like foot long cookies now and churros and pretzels that's insane i looked how many calories there were in that thing and in the cookie one and that's in like oh, over 12 1200 yeah but apparently it's good like i'd definitely share that with someone but like my goodness we're fat we are so fat or strawberry or regular, I confidently responded, Lemonade! I went yeah. to the store while taking a sip of my drink, and when the lady said hello, I just... <laughs> a friend who is from Florida said that when Jeez. he worked at Taco Bell, someone threw a baby alligator through the drive through window. Then came no way. in, asking for it back! No way! Wait, was this Florida? I walked into a store while taking a sip of my drink, and when the lady said hello, I just... Oh. No, wait, I just want the alligator through the drive through window. It was Florida, that makes sense. Okay. One second. One second, one second, one second. Yeah, man, so like I said, I already told you that was I'm sure a lot of people do that too, whenever someone says enjoy your food, you're just like you too. I'm pretty sure when I used to work at Target, because I used to work at Target, we don't talk about it anymore, but like, <laughs> someone said thank you, and I said, wait, no, not thank you. I'm pretty sure someone said thank you, and I said you too. <sighs> like, for helping them. It just slips your mind at that point. Like, what can you do? Again, I don't work there anymore, thank goodness, but comment any customer service brain rots you had, what jobs you worked at and stuff, because, uh, yeah, we've all been there, right?